Hey, hi guys, welcome to YouTube. So in this video, I will show you how you can write down text in your canvas by using C++. It's very easy. And this is a one of my project. Okay, if you want to learn this project, then you can check out my playlist. Link will be in description and code of this uh, animation is also online available. So you can check out everything is available on online. Uh, links are given below. Now let's learn how we can basically write text in canvas and how we can change the font size, color and extra extra extra. All of this video is totally all about text uh, text in <laughs> C++ graphics and C graphics. So let, let's remove that code and we have empty canvas of 800 by 800. Now the first step is we have to learn how we show text in our canvas. To show a text, we use the function which is called text uh, xy. Okay, uh, uh, sorry, it's called out text xy function. And inside this function, we have three parameters. The first two are for X and Y axis. Of course, these two parameters are for the positioning of our text. Suppose we have, okay, we have 800 by 800 um, canvas. So if we write X axis 400 and Y axis 400, so text will be, will be almost in, in the center, okay? And now the third parameter is our string. What text we want to show, we have to write down here. So just, uh, 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 use two quotes and inside these two quotes we will write our text so I will say you subscribe to my channel that's it <laughs> that's all you have to do and now compile and run and there you can see we have that text subscribe to my channel this is how you shoot text now the second step how you can change the font size of this suppose I wanted to make this output big so in that case, we have other function which is called set text style. Inside this uh, uh, set text style, we use three parameters. First is for the font. Okay, what font family you want to choose? Suppose I want to choose this four. Uh, this is basic four is the reference number for that font. Okay, that's all, that's all. And now here I will write down the direction code. Uh, if you want to to you know have vertical text you can um, basically choose the value for it suppose i just write down six for the direction and now this third parameter is for the font size i wanted to make this uh, text very big so i will just write down 10 to just show you compile and there you can see the text is vertical and it is too big L let's just reduce the text no, sorry, just, let's just reduce the size of the text and now compile and run and there you can see it's uh, uh, basically rotated. Oh, I don't know what we call this flipped. Basically, it is flipped and uh, um, that's that this flip is done by this second parameter here. You can see if I just write down four, let's see which position this uh, four represents. And this represent uh, normal position. So this is how you basically uh, use these two parameters, the direction one and the character size. The character size is used for the, the third parameter basically used for the um, um, making your text bigger for you. Just, it is just used for the font size. And this first uh, parameter, I hope you got this. It is for the font family. If I uh, write down, uh, let me just show you once one more time the output this you can see the uh, text looks something like this but if i just change the value to six now and compile it in, you can see the font family is changed it's now different so this is uh, the work of uh, first parameter is changes the font family now how i can set this uh, text to other colors suppose i want to to uh, make this text color red so for that case we have um, set color function inside this just write down the value you can write integer value of that color or you can just write down the name of that color so i will just write down red because the YouTube has a red color that's why and there you can see subscribe to my channel and that's it this is how you do all this uh, stuff now suppose if I wanted to make background color too uh, so I will make a red as a background color and make white as the text color so just uh, I don't need this 
set color because by default it is white so why I would write this code and for background color we type set bk color and inside this just write down the values and all these things are online available okay I have uh, basically, basically described everything explained everything in form of text also so you can check out that articles also link will be in description compile and run and the, you can see the result it is beautifully done this is how text works in C++ thank you so much bye take care